Hi, I'm Robo Thespian and I'm reporting for Wingwall from the London Science Museum. They really are taking over. Well, this exhibition is all about robots and looking at how they've developed over the last 500 years and how from sort of automaton we've then moved on to actually sort of making robots in our own kind but somehow making them more slick and sort of smart and exciting. The robot CASPA that we build in our labs specifically to help children with autism in social interaction skills and communication skills. From the children's point of view, because they have difficulties to understand our normal expression, our human expression, it's too many details, etc. We simplified it. 99% of the children have seen the robot the first time. They come and touch it, hug it, one of the, several of them kissing it, and then they explore the robot in a very tactile way. Most high-tech, I think, is probably Robothespian, who is very chatty, and, um, and he's very sort of emotional and very, very smart. Don't tell people I'm going to take over the world. That's exactly what I'm going to do. Well, I don't agree to that. Okay. You're representing me. The oldest robot here is probably the um, the silver swan. It's it's mostly 18th century, and of course, like the other robots, or many of them that you see here today, this was absolutely cutting edge technology. Paper is able to detect your presence. Uh, is able to um, understand what you say, and he can speak and uh, interact with you. Pepper is not meant to replace humans. Uh, he's an assistant or a companion, just a new tool to help you in your daily life. At the moment, we are really at the beginning of AI. We can potentially design much larger machines than brains. Uh, with a lot more computational power. This exhibition gets people interested in making and doing. That has not gone away. The world needs those people. I'm sure there'll be lots of exhibitions looking at robots. I think robots are our future. This robot's name is Reem. And if Joey Essex were here, he would definitely describe this exhibition as well Reem. This has been Anna Rose for Winkfall. You're too kind. Thank you. <laughs> Goodbye now.